how brisinifovir oral medication and plasma transfusions work to combat the Ebola virus. Parts of West Africa are continuing to battle the spread of Ebola as a U.S. nurse undergoes treatment after contracting the virus from a Liberian patient. Hospital officials say the deceased patient from Liberia, Thomas Eric Duncan, was taking brisinifovir, while the nurse, Nina Pham, has undergone a plasma transfusion. Hospital officials said that the Dallas patient from Liberia who contracted Ebola was taking brisinifovir, or CMX-001, an oral experimental drug developed by Chimerix. Brisinifovir has a lipid side chain that detaches, releasing high amounts of citifovir into the body. Cells add phosphate groups that produce citifovir diphosphates that block the polymerase enzymes the Ebola virus uses to make copies of its genome. The nurse in Texas who contracted Ebola has undergone a plasma transfusion, which entails taking blood from a survivor of the virus and separating the cellular components from the plasma, which should contain Ebola antibodies. After the resulting serum is transfused into the sick patient, antibodies attach to the Ebola virus, preventing it from entering a person's cells. An investigation is underway to determine how Pham contracted the virus, as officials say she was wearing full protective gear when she provided care to Duncan at Texas Health Presbyterian Hospital. Thank <laughs> you.